The gong... <clears throat> the gong rings loud, performers crowd round. <laughs> hey, that sounded pretty good. of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision! Break!
The gong. <clears throat> the gong rings loud. Fighting is meaningless. Forget your walls. <laughs> Tough luck running into me. Let's make it. Yeah. Move carefully. Of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Get right! Tough running into me! <laughs> Rules are made to be broken. Too late to repent.
So strange. Seems like Asta and Arlen are in trouble. Be different as soon as the such is the what do you mean? Are you thinking of well solving a matter like <laughs> I have a friend. First of all, it's just that I don't know her. I'll be waiting till we make it. Oh, Move carefully. My turn! Forget your get run! Let's make it quick. The truth of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision! of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision! Quick! Forget your wallet? Here! Let's make it quick. You can't run! I've no interest in con- Fighting is meaningless. Thank you. 
Move carefully. Forget your wallet? Gotta try hard some- Watch this awesome move! Rules are made to be broken. The truth of life in the sanctuary is but a vision! Break! Nice to have new survival skills under my belt.
I'm not done yet. <sighs> Just as the data bank requires updating, so I must keep evolving.
position. Break! Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Who's next? Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Who's next? Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. But efficient! Break!
fighting is meaningless. My turn. <laughs> the truth of life in this sanctuary is but a vision. Break. Let's make it quick. Huh. That was a heck of a performance. Wanna know the secret? Well, my lips are sealed. The truth of life, the sanctuary, is but a vision. Break! Turn out your pockets! Come feast your happy new year! <laughs> Here! <laughs> Try that again! Pretty good.
snatch it all up! the game <laughs> Let's make it quick Truth of life in the sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Tough luck running. That was a heck of a performance. to be broken. Interesting conflict. Forget your wallet? Try that again. Tough luck running into me. <laughs> Don't throw the game. The truth of life and death, revealed in an in the sanctuary, is but a vision! Break! Don't 
told you I could fight. <laughs> Here! Yeah! Fighting is meaningless. Don't throw the game! My turn! Rules are made to be broken. The gong... <clears throat> the gong rings loud, performers crowd round. <laughs> hey, that sounded pretty good.
Busier places mean busier business. Ah, young lady. I wanted to see you off. But, you know, hmm. something you wanted to... Fortunately, Sparrow, well, you still have a lot. Well, my friends, are you ready to head out? Wonderful! Are you hurt? I'll fetch the butler right away. No, there's no need. I don't want to see Sebas right now. Sorry, Mother. I I'm fine, really. I just got into a few skirmishes down in the underworld, but nothing I couldn't handle. The underworld? Oh, I see. In that case, report everything you saw. Commander Branya. After the failed pursuit at Backwater Pass, the wanted outsiders and I were somehow taken to the underworld. Because of the difficult situation we were in, we formed a temporary alliance to help the residents of the underworld resolve a few issues of survival. We also defeated an ancient robot known as Svarog and learned some truths about the Stellar I'm listening. Go on. Madame Kakolia, it is my firm belief that the visitors from beyond the sky are not the villains we had imagined before. I witnessed them take up arms in the name of justice and risk their lives for the sake of others. I can also ascertain that they did come for the Stellaron, but only to relieve the disaster it has brought upon Bellabog. Mother, you've always known the truth about the Stellaron, haven't you? Well, the responsibility of bearing that truth will fall upon me one day. Such is the burden of being Guardian, to carry these secrets for eternity. So, I ask you to forgive my defiance. I believe that the order to dispatch the Outsiders was a mistake. To solve the problems brought on by the Stellar on the Architects waited hundreds of years. And those Outsiders may be the... the... Enough! What? <sighs> Arrogant. Ignorant. Oh, you disappoint me, Branya. You merely glimpsed the tip of the iceberg. And now you think you know everything. You spend a short time with that underworld scum. And suddenly you have the audacity to question my orders? Guards! Take Branya. They are not scum. My entire life. Everything you ever kept from me. I remember it clearly now. This time, 
This time I am standing my ground, Madam Guardian. And please, stop dismissing me with vague excuses. Tell me what you have seen. What exactly it is you are hiding. Why do you send the Silvermane Guards to die in the Fragmentum? Why have you abandoned the people of the Underworld? And why? Why did you have that sudden change of mind? Huh. I see. I knew this moment would come sooner or later. I just... didn't expect it would be so soon. You want to know why I gave those orders? Is that right? Do you believe you're ready to learn the truth? Yes. I am ready. Mother. Then come with me, Bronya. It is time you heard it. The voice of this dying world. Reliable Sampo. He probably guessed we'd ask where his hiding place was. No sooner are we back in the administrative district than he sneaks off. No way, Don Hung. I think it'd be better. So you. He's an elite. Mm, makes sense. But. We must keep a low profile. We're still wanted fugitives. What's wrong, Zila? Nothing. It's just a little... new. The last time I was on the surface, I was still a child. I have no memory of any of this. The overworld and the underworld. We've... We've been cut off for so long. I'm okay. Let's go. There are so many Silvermane guards on patrol. Is it usually like this? No. I don't remember the security being this tight last time. <sighs> Might have something to do with us. The Supreme Guardian has probably learned of our arrival already. Vranya. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Huh? Ah, I remember. The three outsiders. Wait, why are you still strolling around the city? Do you know the Silvermane guards are looking all over for you? Quick, act natural and get inside. Don't get spotted. All right, you'll be safe here. My workshop has pretty good soundproofing and... Barely anyone comes in. Just what crime did you commit, exactly? They recalled a bunch of guards from the front line to track you down. It's unprecedented. Now they're patrolling the whole city, and everyone's in a panic! Oh, we just... Not yet, March. Rania said we could trust you completely. You mean to say you don't trust me completely? Good. That's smart of you. But you needn't worry. Kokolia and I aren't even on speaking terms. It was her that ejected me from the Architects. I refuse to stand with her. I don't believe you guys would do anything bad. And the Architects are going to need conclusive and publicly available evidence for me to think otherwise. Besides, I know the Architects, and if they did have any evidence, they would have released it by now. 
I know Kokolia's style. Get everyone into a frenzy first. Most people in a frenzy don't stop to ponder the details. <laughs> you could say that. We were like sisters once, inseparable. Of course, that was all before she became the supreme guardian. These days, I just spend my time fixing things in this workshop and playing music. It's a pretty carefree existence. If I'm not careful, I'll start boring you all with sob stories from the past. Let's get back to you guys. If long lost Branya told you to come here, you must have something important to tell me. You can trust me. I know our paths have only crossed once before, but my intuition tells me you guys are good people. And I've got good intuition, by the way. <laughs> Let me! Let me! Uh, try not to embellish the facts. So that's what's been happening. No wonder we hadn't heard from Branya recently. After all these years in isolation, and without a single word from below, this is what's become of the Underworld? I believe you. There's no way you could have invented all those twists and turns. What's more, we have Miss Zila here as living proof. As for the Stellaron... <sighs> I know why Branya got you to find me. When I was still one of the architects working in the Scientific Research Division, I was researching the Stellaron. I never thought I'd hear that word again after being expelled by the architects. Come on, I'll tell you everything. Only a very few people, but according to the just my maybe I should be thank. Yes. According to We must locate it as not a problem. The area to the north, even if you get past the restrict Yes. That's where the main force of the Silvermane Guards is stationed. They've consolidated their position there in order to resist the encroaching Fragmentum. It sounds like the three of us and Zila might not be enough. Why don't we go back underground and get Wildfire to come with us? I fear we may not have the time. Hey, enough pessimism. Back in my official capacity days, I spent a lot of time in the North. I got to know the soldiers and officers on the front line very well. This calls for brainwaves, not brawn waves. How about I take you over myself? Really? Great! Phew. It's less scary if someone you know is leading the way. <laughs> I want to see the Stellaron too, you know. It was my research topic for over a decade. You don't get that many decades in life. That's settled then. There's no time to lose. We should head out as soon as you're ready.
darn it! I forgot my brother said he'd be around today. Find somewhere to hide, quick! I'll handle him. Japard! It's you! I didn't think you'd have the time to visit with things so tense on the front line. <laughs> things are manageable. The latest wave of monster attacks has slowed. I'm back in the city to take care of a few matters, but I'll be back on the front line later. I thought I told you. Ah! Oh, yes. That's right. Sis, you look a bit pale. Did something happen? N no Why would anything have happened? You don't normally use my full name. Uh, you said you hate it when I call you bro in public. Well, I agree. It'd sound better if I started using your full name. Right, Brosish? You can call me whatever you like. Look, Serval, I'm here on official business today. There's something wrong with the barrier generator device, and the engineers in our unit don't know how to fix it. I need you to take a look. Those guys can't think outside the box. Of course they can't wrap their heads around my...